Welcome everybody, it's Travis Strikes Again, colon, No More Heroes. There's a bit of a surprise. It's it's maybe a No More Heroes game. This is the game that was the interim uh, between No More Heroes 2 and 3. Everybody was really hoping for No More Heroes 3 and, oh, we're, we're, we're getting there, we're getting there. We're not there yet, but we're getting there. So uh, this is... I think going to be more of a stream game than a let's play game because I think it involves like repeating stuff. I'm going to see how stream friendly this is. When I eventually get to No More Heroes 3, I think that'll be a let's play, but this game I think we could do in like the sort the sort of stream format. So let's take a look cuz I, I I've never played this. I don't know what's going to happen. All I can tell you is that it came with DLC, but you can see I have the the complete edition. I imported a a physical copy. So I have the DLC included, which some of it sounds pretty interesting. Let's take a look. Behold. We got Mystery Man and Travis Touchdown. I don't know what to expect. Now for starters, got a black screen. Okay, there we go. Finally, I was getting a little nervous. There's that Killer7 cell shaded look. Far more Killer7 than No More Heroes. But hey, Grasshopper 20th anniversary, that's pretty cool. Because Grasshopper got started in, like, the PS1 with the silver case. This is such a Killer7 look, what the hell? Like, this, this is not No More Heroes. Like, I know this isn't a Wii game anymore, but this is extremely Killer7. Sweet dreams, huh? <laughs> How did you find you Oh, I heard about this. Get away from me? Goddamn filthy bum tried to get cute and pay some Do you recognize that voice? Because I do. But unfortunately for you, my nose is sharper than any other man's. Any other dog's, too, for that matter. You're sick. They you know, brought this the guy back. Wait a sec. Just give me 30 seconds. I can explain. You got 10. Okay. There's a reason I ran away. I know that don't make it okay. But I felt real bad for selling you out to Curtis. Your 10 seconds. Oh, are you up. sold him out to Curtis? Go to hell. Curtis will be waiting for you. Vengeance. For my daughter. My little girl was murdered. I had to avenge her. That's Is that what that was? Alive. You hear that, Mills? Yeah. Find the asshole who killed his kid. Now. Seven this is some deep lore. I can't find him. Listen, Birkin. The score is zero to nothing. Two outs, bottom of the ninth. You're up to bat. Three balls and two strikes. You're up against the wall. The next pitch decides the game. You either kill or be killed. You're late. Okay, got it. No way. It only takes a pro two seconds. Your guy is hiding out in Texas, in the middle of nowhere. Hello, What's Dragon Ace and Insane Buffoon. We're getting before. some deep lore. Travis touchdown. Yeah, I remember. He's the champ up above ground, huh? This guy knows about Travis? This is weird. Kill him and bring your daughter back. Then we're all square. You smoke a crack or what? Bring him back. I know Travis isn't gonna lose, but don't think too much. This guy isn't gonna lose either. With muscle. It'll just give you a headache. Whoa! I lost the guy on the cover. Holy shit. This is your final ball. Looks like my luck has changed. Shitty luck. But luck all the same. I'm gonna knock this last homer out of the goddamn park. Don't end up getting beamed now. That's called a death ball, by the way. Now go kill Travis Touchdown. So Dan isn't gonna do it himself? 
There's no way, because if he did, then they'd both win. You're not beating Dan Smith. But you're not beating Travis Touchdown either. That is incredible. Dan Smith. Collateral shot. Hello there, Shiler Eye. Welcome to the stream. That is nuts. Yeah, if Dan Smith told me to do something, I would do it. Terrifying, man. He killed two of the handsome men. What are you gonna do to that guy? Alright. Time to play ball. Sorry, bro, you're already dead. Take one more step. And you're dead. It's too late. I like Miami. Die! Really fucked up now, old man. You wanna play? Let's play. Bring it, nerd. Pay your debt in blood! I was just caught by Miami with the music and everything. Wait a long time. Is a new with, um, Hydrogen by Moon. Let me at least introduce myself. Travis Touchdown. You murdered my daughter. Don't pretend you forgot. <laughs> now quit making this shit confusing. They need to know about the most badass... The noble and pedigree and middleware. So who's Charlotte? Like bad girl? The gamers. Your fight is here in the real world. Son of a bitch. Oh my god, that was a great directed by screen. That was amazing. The Death Drive Mark II, the Phantom Game Console. Well, there, drummer guy. Welcome to the stream. And yeah, Shadow Rider. That's probably the hotel from Killer Seven. Would not be surprised. That is amazing. I am all in. Good lord. Um, now, by the way, how's my voice doing and how's the game's music and voices doing? Do we have a proper balance here? Oh, and Dragonist, thank you for the, uh, the well wishes from Twitch. And, yeah, General Ledger, is the daughter bad girl? That's what I'm wondering. Like, how many daughters has Travis killed? Like, he killed, uh, that woman with the prosthetic leg. Uh, he killed... Bad girl. I mean, there's Speedbuster, but come on, she was like super old. Then there's No More Heroes 2, where he killed Alice, Twilight, and Margaret Moonlight. Well, they wouldn't be Charlotte, would they? And then there's that Metal Gear Solid woman. I doubt she's a Charlotte, so I don't freaking know. Oh, oh, Shy Ride Jean. Duh, I should have gotten that. I really should have gotten that. <laughs> How embarrassing. She's the most plot important character. Uh, okay, so new game, I guess. Oh, I forgot about that. Bitter, mild, and sweet. Although, isn't hard mode usually on the bottom? But sweet is on the bottom? Alright. I'll do mild. Why not? To the 51, you absolute mad lad. And Travis is playing Hotline Miami? Why? He already does that shit in real life. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the 1960s. Freaking Dan Smith, though. Dan Smith wants Travis Touchdown dead. That's terrifying. Meanwhile, Electric Thunder Tiger 2. Huh. I don't know what this is. Static loading screen. Is this freaking Michigan report from hell? Which, by the way, I should play at some point. That is also a pseudo game. <laughs> the Terminator entrance. <laughs> Your clothes. Give them to me. Oh, never mind. We're good. Move. I can do that. Look at this rad freaking, uh, well, what is it? I guess HUD vignette, kind of. So do I fight this guy? It's freaking Star Fox. Hey, can I ask you something? Is this the game world? Death. Hey, wait, you can't just walk in on here. This area is off limits. 
Okay, I gotta remember, this game was Switch first. Did Let It Die already exist? I don't think this is Uncle Death, but... Apparently this game references freaking Killer7. I mean, No More Heroes 1 did as well, but this is just straight up Dan Smith from Killer7 <laughs> wants to kill Travis Touchdown. And from what I am aware of, this game references, or I forgot if it was this or No More Heroes 3, or both, references stuff that America, like, officially never got. So we'll find out. Don't worry, I'll explain it to you, because America finally did get it, <laughs> like, decades later. This entire area is sealed off. The government has issued an evacuation order. Whatever, man. If this is a game, I'm gonna clear it for sure. You can't stop me. Stay out of my way. You just don't get it. Do you have a permit? What the hell are you talking about? Of course I don't. We can take you out by force, you know. Oh, that sounds fun. Bring it on, then. Don't underestimate video games. <laughs> That's a pretty good uh, screen cap moment there. Hello there, Rich Toto. Oh, welcome to the stream. Transform! Huh? It's not working. Insufficient funds. Not enough DD coins. What a shame, Travis. I was going to kill you in the tutorial. It looks like I still need more karma. The journey is not yet over. The time to destroy the world is yet to come. Look, this is taking forever. This is what sucks about games these days. It takes too long to finally start playing. Anyway, get your hands on a permit before we meet again. We'll overlook it for now. Just clear the usual mission-style events. Wow, this is on the nose. No More Heroes 1 was a heavy illusion, but this is just... direct. Goodbye! I can still... See ya. Square swings. Circle rolls. Oh, I can just jump! Triangle, alright. Huh, huh, huh. Uh, R1, L1... I don't know what that is. I guess set abilities that I don't have yet? D-pad does nothing. It looks like this is ready to charge. Do, do I shake the controller? We don't do we have six axes here? I think we might actually. Hold on. Can I run out of battery? If I hold L3, I think I might actually shake the controller. And yeah, Dragon Ace, his name is Touchdown. There are no touchdowns in baseball. Well, the baseball guy is the opponent. Uh, in No More Heroes 2, there was a football guy who was like, Travis Touchdown, I love your name. Uh, so here's some coins. Just big video game coins. LB. Should I know what that means? LB dollars. Oh, come on. What, what was the name of... Uh... Jeez, what was the name of the place where he lives? Was it Los Santos? Do I have that right? Oh, Dragon Ace, doesn't he use a bat? No, he uses a lightsaber. Which he could sometimes swing as a bat. Uh, and there are baseball references in No More Heroes, but Suda51 just loves baseballs. A baseball. Like, he made a Kinect game where you're like a pitcher from hell. He, he, he just likes baseball. Here's a thing. Bug Street Boys, red. What the? Welcome to the Death Drive Mark II! I'm the creator of this machine, Dr. Juvenile. Come on, what are you, freaking Hideo Kojima? The Death Drive is connected to your nervous system via the Death Glove. Keep concentrating or else you're gonna die. The controls are intuitive. Thanks. So you'll get used to them. We'll start by going over the basic controls. Let's take out some enemies. Oh, I can hold square. Try it out. Go, go. Bonk. Whoa. I didn't think just one hit would do it. Bonk. What if I hold it? Oh, no way! Basic attack while running. I noticed. It's especially useful when enemies close in as a group. We call this a rush attack. Get to it. Go, go, go! Wow. But that kills my battery. This is busted. However, I want to charge. I want to do the freaking embarrassing motions to charge the controller. Bug, bug, Sputnik, red. You've gotten the hang of the basic attack, but there's more. Next is the heavy attack. Useful against the tougher enemies and enemies who guard. Go on, try it out. Yeah. 
very satisfying. Your weapon is almost out of power. Yeah, you shake the stick at a six axis or do the right stick. I'll try I, I tried the six axis at first, because that's how like the Wiimote would work, but I'll try right stick. Your attacks consume energy from the death drive mark too, but a bug in the system is preventing power from being properly distributed. So why is it called Death Drive Mark II? It's not like the something berry. Oh my god, what was the name of his sword? Bloodberry. You'll have to recharge your weapon manually to get more power. To recharge, shake the control up and down. If it runs out of energy, your attacks won't do much damage, so recharge often. Show me what you got! Do it now! Wow, that took no time at all, considering I was like a third of the way down. Alright! Oh, Rich Toto, Santa Destroy. Thank you, I can't believe I blew it. So I still don't know what LB dollars are, though. And I can jump. There's rubble in the way and you can't go further. Or, you know, farther. This is what jump is for. What are you waiting for? Jump, jump, jump! I guess further or farther. Farther. Wee. Wow. Whoa. I can't manipulate the camera. A pretty cool move is to use the basic attack in the air to launch yourself at enemies standing away from you. Okay, try it out. Go, go, go! Oh my god, that's amazing. Hey, you, the immature ass gamer, stop now. You're not doing as I say. Do it your order, or I'll burn your brains to a crisp. But I did, though. I guess I killed one of them by holding the button down. Jump and heavy attack works best when enemies are bunched up. Of course, it's also good for breaking an enemy's guard. Okay, try it out. Yep, there we go. Get the hell out of here. Dealing damage is important, but avoid taking damage. Avoiding taking damage is important too. So you'll need to learn to dodge. Make sure to try it out. Go, go, go! Alright, so circle dodges. Just, just, there's no enemies here, but I'll do it anyway. I dodged. I'm a pro. Let's get some. Let's get some bucks. Just do whatever I want with these guys. Oh, no, 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 no. Charge attack. R1. R1. Shake R1? A charge attack is a simple but powerful move. The charge attack builds up as you attack enemies, so use it once it's full. You have a crackling red beam now? Okay. When you use a charge attack, your charge level will go up. The higher the charge level, the stronger the charge attack. However, the charge level will decrease if you take heavy damage. Be careful when fighting and try not to take damage. You can use the Choco Banana Crepe with Caramel Ice Cream attack in two-player co-op. Or Choco Banana. Hold down the charge once your power has been built up. Once it's full, you can unleash a super strong beam. It feels good. Oh, wow. Yeah, Valkathon. Is LB a play on words for pounds? That'd be clever. LB, that'd be amazing. Try it out up ahead. Er Did I blow it? Mediocre. I got glow, eh? Am I good? I love that sound. From the silver case, by the way.
charge and enhance. There it is. A little clunky to pull off the charge attack, but it's fine. Uh, are we okay? Alright, I'm locked in. Dr. Juvenile here. So you haven't died yet. As you can see, there's a toilet here. But not just an ordinary toilet. A save point. You don't know when you're gonna die, so be sure to save. For your first save at each toilet, you'll get some money as a special gift. Uh, Dragon Ace, who's Travis? Uh, he's the main character of No More Heroes. He's an otaku weeb loser who's into wrestling, and he got involved in the plot of the game so he could get a chance at having sex with the woman who, uh, commissioned him. And, uh, like, the whole thing was just, like, a sort of satire against video games, and, like, just the protagonist is making fun of you, the player, directly at points. As you'll notice, my charge animation is, uh... Well, this is more shaking, but, like... The way he holds the Wemo and shakes it, and the way you, the player, had to hold the Wemo and shake it to charge, uh, is rather an innuendo. Uh, no More Heroes 2, his friend was killed, and he spent that game going for revenge. Anyway, toilet. This is how you save in all three games. People used to joke about that in like the mid 2000s, like I'm taking a save. I'll just get an Unreal Engine shirt, which is kind of funny. I think there are more shirts than like video game shirts. Level up and skills, I don't think I'm doing that right now. Not a chance. Uh, character select. I can just play as Badman? Are you freaking kidding? But why? Is this gonna be like Anarchy Reigns where the two stories coincide with each other at the end? Uh, co-op? Well, I'm not doing that now. Or, you know, ever, but certainly not on stream. Uh, moving on. White Sheep Man? What? Should I recognize this? I know this kind of came up in, um, Catherine, sort of, and Yakuza 7, sort of. Travis Touchdown, welcome to the world of Electric Thunder Tiger 2. You can call me White Sheep Man, I'm the memory manager here. You found the Death Ball and booted up the Death Drive Mark II. The journey is long but short. The survivors are desperate. After turning from the main character to the ruler of this world, Triple Star lost his reason to exist. You should know more than anyone that the chains of freedom are the most painful of all. That's enough talk for now. We'll meet again. He really didn't say, like, anything. Whoa. Huh. Pretty cool. Whoa. That is very satisfying. Doo -doo -doo -doo. That's the sound for getting like a puzzle solution correct in the silver case. Not that we could have possibly known that until the 2010s. Unless we like found the fan translation for the game or something. God, that is satisfying. Well, you just got us a skill chip. When you get a new skill chip, you will unlock a new skill to use. Even a monkey like you can master them, so use them as much as possible. You will end up collecting lots of different skills. You can manage and arrange them from the skill set menu within the level up and skills menu in the pause menu. I've already set this one for you. Test it out, and show me what you got. Soderbug. What? Anyway, I don't know what the skill is, let's test it out. What? Oh, that's the- okay, and it recharges over time. So that's what that is in my L menu with the squares. I'll let it rebuild one more time so I can see what that properly was. You can see it in my uh, four buttons on the left side of the screen. It's almost full, the top button. We're good. Let's see what that actually was. I had to shoot him. Alright. 
Anyway. I got ahead HP to last. Nice. Once you use a skill, you won't be able to use it again straight away. But after some time, you'll be able to use it again, so just be smart about it. It may be hard with your brains, but try to do your best. Who is this new character? I'm curious. Oh, these guys can actually take a hit. Set of power. Oh, these guys are the ones with the big hits. Good enough. Uh oh. Clumsy on my part. It's fine. Or right, or neither. Okay. This is Dr. Juvenile. I'll let you in on something important. If you go to the options in this game's pause menu, you can change the difficulty level anytime. Depending on the situation, sometimes you just want to enjoy a sweet game, and sometimes you want to take on a bitter challenge. Well, I'm sure a gamer like you would never choose sweet mode, but still. Wow, the sass, Suda51. Alright, just checking. Nice. Looks like you've scored some provisions from Hazray. Boxes like this are full of various supplies and cash. Uh, okay. Dr. Juven, Juven, Juven. <laughs> oh, wow, this bodes well. Ah, that's why you look. I'm a genius. Travis Touchdown. Welcome to the world of Electric Thunder Tiger 2. Your status as a hardcore gamer is well known even here. Wow. Bet that gives you a hard on, doesn't it? Oh, that was just it. Okay. Is Travis known for being a hardcore gamer? He does have that pure white Glastonbury shooter, but like, I always took him as more of a wrestling guy. And yeah, Shirai, I am the Emperor. That absolutely crossed my mind. This is the final battle! Buck Street Boys. Blue. Real quick. 267. I'm not going to have to do anything. Good, they still go down in one. At least one heavy. 
but it still goes out in one light. It's just a big shoot too. Makes them a little scarier. I appreciate the vignette in the lower right corner. That, like they kind of show me where they're coming from. Anyway, excuse me, guys. I wonder if there's gonna be like lollipop chainsaw where the whole gimmick is you just grind the levels to like boost your high score, your currency, or whatever. Nothing here. Very linear paths, which positive and negative. Yes. Yeah. What's R1 for? It just does he's just holding a sign that says R1. Does that mean I can use my super? Whoa, hello. Is this Speedbusters level with like a hundred power poles? But there's too many of them. I can see this getting into a bullet hole hell if I don't like put a lid on it real quick. Like, uh, this can easily get out of hand. Whoa. Boog Boog Sputnik Blue. That one looks a little uh, intimidating. Also, shooting stuff. But they seem to be just as weak as any of the other enemies, except that they can fire projectiles, which is bad. Oh, it's wrong button. Although that was going well. Uh, what did I want to do? L1. That's pretty good. I caught more than one. Really? Get out of here. More cash monies. A lot of chance was an experience. You are not getting. I heard the remake in the game, but without all the the licensed music, it's just not gonna be the same. <sighs> Look at that background. What the hell is this? I guess I'm in video game land. I'm trying to read what his shirt says. Like Unreal Engine was something wasted. And yeah, shout out, I love these enemies in mocap suits. Oh, these are the red ones. These are the nothing enemies. Yeah, that's not really scary, not scary, another blue. Another red again. Oh, it's both! Oh my god! Looks like you get another skill chef. Oh, I guess she was fixed. Be sure to check the da, da, da. Check his uh, four buttons. Group together the skills you use most to save them as presets. Use that broke ass head of yours to find the combination that best suits you. You got it, buddy. Yeah, Travis and Batman, it's wild. If I spend Travis's skill, do I. Oh no, that's for level up. Okay. Anyway. Skill. So, Shining Chef. Binds characters, blow them away freely. Oh, hold down the button to bind. Oh! And then, other skill. Psycho Chip. Multiple shots in the Death Club. Temporary immobilizes characters' head. You got my attention, buddy. So let me just take it for a test run here. So I have to wait for it to charge. That's interesting. So no cheating. Like, the moment I use a skill, quickly equip a different skill and it's fully charged. Nope. No cheating. So, hold the button. Well, it just fired anyway. I'll wait for that to regenerate. But I'll... I'll wait for the circle one to regenerate. I equipped it to circle. And then I'll run forward so I can get into a fight. I'll see what that looks like. I am rather excited. This does look like a simple stream-friendly game so far, though. I don't know if I'd want to let's play something like this. It feels a little too arcadey. So... Oh, it's a shotgun. Alright, yeah. I get it. Can I just stun lock this guy? That's a lot of projectiles. Let's, let's get rid of these people. That's a distressing amount of enemies.
Okay, they take away too much first, nice. That's how it works. So I could shoot one nearby enemy into other enemies. Like, okay, I think I'm getting it. Gotcha. I think I'm starting to see how this stuff works. Not bad. Now I'm gonna go the wrong way first, and there's nothing here. I think I'm probably faster running than rolling. Jump doesn't help me with speed. Very satisfying, I'm telling you. Let's test this out. That's so cool! Yeah, I could stun like this guy as long as I can twice. This just scared there's more enemies. You know what? This game's alright. That's a ramen stall in the traditional Japanese yatai style. Pretty cool. There are ramen stalls from all around Japan throughout each stage. Even the ramen will replenish your energy and power you up too. It'll even pump up a chump like you, so be sure to stop by. Ramen is the soul food of Japan. I traveled all over Japan just for this. What are you waiting for? Alright. Does it cost cash? Bogjiro, we've got a customer. Welcome, come on in. Give me your best ramen. Sure thing. Here you go. I just take it. This is awesome. I had ramen a couple days ago. Very, very good. Ooh, Tokyo shoyu. I even had shoyu. Simple and beautiful. Refreshing soy sauce based. Oh, refreshing soy sauce based soup made with bonito broth. Delish. Power recovered. You got anything? Yes. Bugstra. Grandpa's words of wisdom. If a man's gonna cry, he should cry in his dreams. If he still wants to cry, he should dry his tears. Thanks, buddy. Bitcoin? This is Dr. Juvenile. Looks like you've scored an Azteca stone. You could exchange it for a special t-shirt back at the trailer. Yeah, video game shoutouts. I think it's a bunch of uh, indie game shoutouts. Left takes me somewhere. Oh dear. I'll go left. Earthbound logic. And inside is probably some boss arena, but let's check out the right side. Oh, okay. This ought to be good. That's a little scary actually. Fine. I'm very excited. There's a certain sense of satisfaction to be had in just pulling this off. This is great. You recharge really quickly, I appreciate that. Shot, that's fine too. Aha. Alright, we're good. Hooray, thing opens.
Looks like you built up plenty of XP. Once you built up enough XP, you could increase your level. I could level up either Travis or Badman. And if you're confident, you could try skipping the level up and seeing how far you can get as is, like a real gamer. Okay, now go, 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 go! Yeah, let's see what that entails. I could just play as Badman, like that's so weird. Anyway. Oh, hold the button down. <laughs> Did you just say bitchin'? That's amazing. So, my attack is 55, my max HP is 220, versus Badman's 45 and 240. Alright. Bitchin', that's such a 90s thing to say. Welcome to wherever this is. Very industrial. Oh, whoops, I missed that. Well, left is the coins, which makes me kind of want to go right. Because it's a little too obvious. Oh. Or we're going left. And yeah, Winterburn, it's rare that a game will just straight up call you a filthy casual. It's already done that, too. Like, oh, I don't know if a real gamer would play on sweet difficulty. Go the other way, just to say. Aha! See? My infinite wisdom. Look at all my mega bucks. Oh! I have so much money. New enemy type? Whoa, bug gates. The hell? What do you throw bombs? Well, I got him. He holds. How do you like that? I have come full circle, it looks like. Too bad I can't manipulate the camera. I'd like to kind of see ahead if I could. Otherwise, I guess I'll just grab without that. Anymore. So what? I guess that is a big explosion. Alright, this gives me coins, but there's something more dangerous. Yeah, okay, this is too obvious. Something more dangerous than electricity. Oh, I tried. Anyway, reward. I got an ass pick of stone. I can't wait to get genuinely cool t-shirts. I do kind of want to drop this Unreal <laughs> t-shirt. And I have two stones. I wonder if any shirt costs more than the other, or if this is just a matter of, uh... Okay. Or if this is a matter of just, I can get two shirts. Who knows? Alright, fight time. Game's alright. Mm -hmm. Oh, guys, I should probably kill them. 
very satisfying, I'm telling you. I don't think I got anything from here except for a fight, though. This is a dead end. Grandpa's words of wisdom. Don't eat at restaurant chains. Picture the ingredients the head office buys. Picture where the ingredients come from. Picture how they're handled and managed. You can't, can you? Be suspicious of ingredients you can't picture. <laughs> Alright, thanks, Grandpa. I have so much money. You'll see a lot of these deathahedrons appearing throughout the game. You can attack them to open doors or perform various other actions. Go on, attack the deathahedron. Hmm. What? Oh god. Oh no, what have I done? But there's this up here. Bonk. 300 bucks. Where am I? Oh, I see. Alright, I'll, I'll keep this way for now. I can't advance this way, but there is a pleasure shortly. Oh, another Deathahedron. Is that what, that's what that is? I can see this getting real annoying real quick. That's so cool, I could direct it. That's so cool. Useful ability. Oh, so good. Anyway, there's my prize. Was there another shape? Whoop! That didn't tell me, did it? Okay, I was gonna say, I'm gonna feel real stupid in about four seconds. I do have to go back, but I can activate, activate another Deathahedron. I should have to run all the way back, though. Yeah, that's good. So you can fall off, so there are going to be difficult platforming sections in this game at some point, no doubt. What? Oh, I hit the thing a little early, a little premature. Ooh, I wonder. I wonder. Yeah, I, I have to see this for myself. I apologize for this. But hopefully what I'm about to do is going to be worth it. Hopefully. I'm going to undo everything. No, maybe not. There might be nothing there. I'll have to check. I have no choice but to just keep smacking the thing back the way I was. Is there anything to the right? Can I check that? I don't think it's happening. I'll just advance, I'm sorry. I'm digging the music in the meantime. And now hit this. I can go out there, but there's nothing, so I guess I'll just advance. Let's get out of here. This is all the first level, by the way. This is a pretty big deal. Give me that XP. Alright. 
ya. Wow, where do I go? I'm genuinely conflicted on this one. Oh, okay, I chose correctly. Stairs. What a thrill. Easy. Good. Two birds, one stone. Beautiful. Every time, sorry, that does not easy every time. It's close, but I saved it. Save this is going pretty well. Telling you, what does that shirt say? Something with wasted. I don't know, man. Anyway, moving on. Full heal, baby. Power recovered. How did I get here from the outside? Oh, we got boss. It's gotta be boss. Checking the perimeter for safety. Looks like a bunch of nothing. We're doing boss fight. Whoa. Sheet Man Red. That's pretty scary. Are you a player character? Is Triple Star back? Generic Sheet Man. No, no, wait. Just a visitor from another world. Or are you just some punk? I'm an assassin, just passing through. For just passing through, you sure do reek of bloodlust. Yep. You reek of blood, punk. Confirmed. You're a destroyer. Commence slaughter in five seconds. You're a talky-ass monster, aren't you? I'll be merciful and kill you quickly. I can't be defeated easily. This is your first test, punk. You know how scary a mid-boss can be? Underestimate me and I'll get you. I'll make sure you die painfully. Dial it back on the pillow talk. Mid-bosses are usually silent. I don't have many friends. Oh, what the hell does that mean? Don't hesitate for a text box. An opening! A amazing. <laughs> okay, he charges. Oops. He fooled me. He fooled me twice. Wow, I could just straight up interrupt him with this. Amazing. Not so bad. Oh. Well, he shot me. My God, he's too powerful. I don't think they hit me that screen. I'm not doing great at the dodging though. Oh. I wouldn't mind that. Oh, hello. I wouldn't mind being able to see this guy's health bar. Got him. 
That was pretty badass. Oh, once again, uh, the t-shirt is supposed to read Unreal Engine is killing wasted resources with, and it's awesome on the bottom. That's amazing. But the in-game typo seems to have kill wing wasted. Amazing. I gotta see if that's the case. But hey, I beat the boss. I beat the boss. I beat Sheep Red. Hooray, I'm a pro gamer. Look at me. You all saw it. Wow, is this whole game just continuous? We're just in a new level immediately? Like, at what point do I buy t-shirts? Or can I do it, like, now? I can't level up yet. Although I can for Batman. When do I deal with t-shirts? Maybe level 1 just isn't over yet. What you just got is, as you can see, a UE logo, Unreal Engine. You can exchange it for a special t-shirt back in the trailer. Wow! I'm a pro gamer, everybody. You all saw it. Ooh, yikes. Oh, wait, this is the scrubbing. Never mind, I can just kill him easily. Very satisfying, I'm telling you. I love it. Oh, am I out? Excuse me? Aha! Whew! Saved it. Grandpa's words of wisdom. Did you know Japanese people eat cake on Christmas? It's a weird, mysterious tradition. Why don't Japanese people eat Japanese sweets? Christmas should be celebrated with wonderful Japanese sweets. I recommend Mitarashi Dango. Thanks, Grandpa. This is like the horizontal equivalent of uh, an elevator level. I'm just going through a bunch of guys. ultimately going. I beat the mid-boss. I get the feeling that I'm going to wrap up the stream when I beat the first level, but where's the real boss? Um... Bunch of goons is fine. Bunch of goons. Damn. I gotta watch my battery. Oh, that's a lot of bombs. Yeah. That's a lot of bombs. And 
Boom, easy to time. I am actually about to die. Can we find uh, a save point, please? I'd very much appreciate that. Okay, I really need to recharge. I didn't realize how low I was on health. Actually a little nervous now. Oh, oh alright. Wow, couldn't have come at a better time. I was in the red. Thank you. Beautiful. Just what I needed. How much cash do I have? Oh, I can level, actually. It, it says Gene Trailer. Makes me uncomfortable. But, uh, alright. Let's level. Cool. Attack power 60 now. Max HP 240 still? Huh. But still, I'm, I'm a real dangerous guy now. Oh, hello. We got something coming up. Wow. Gorgeous lighting. Grandpa's words of wisdom. People's success stories aren't worth shit. People's stories of failure are worth more than gold. Thanks. Okay, nothing there. It's pretty gorgeous. That's enough. See ya. Very satisfying. Blue ones are a little scary. As you can see. So satisfying, I'm telling you. Bam! Amazing. Now where am I actually going? Can I read that? I don't think so. Is this a pit? No. Oh, I want the coins. Come on. Almost died from all the not quite. I got a stun. Still not bad, huh? I'll let Mr. Bomb go off. Get wrecked, buddies. That's how you do it. I wonder if I get XP for the bombs, as opposed to like if I personally take them out myself. Boy. Boy. Man, I missed that. Oh. Grandpa's words of wisdom. Do what you've left today, tomorrow. Do what you leave tomorrow, the day after tomorrow. But the day after tomorrow, stay up all night. <laughs> Too real. Hardly worth it. The only one that's out. Oh, I'm blowing this. That's better. Good. Boogero? A lost soul from Doom? 
Do I shoot this guy? I'm a little nervous. There's a floating head. Can I read that? No. Looks gorgeous, though. There he goes. Satisfying, I keep saying it. Out of that saying go, never do today, what you could put off until Thursday after next. Yup. Anyway. Ramen. Not a save point, but I can get ramen. Is it different kind, do you think? Are we gonna do one of these? Why is everything bugs? I'm curious. Is it like a video game bug? Is that the joke? Ah! Hakata Tokansu. A great way to end the day. A pork-based western-style all-star. That does look really good. Thanks, buddy. Power recovered. I think I'm just by this. It looks like I should be falling into the void, but it doesn't happen. Oh, dear. Blue one's first. See ya. Ah, oh, still hit me. might be intimidating. How long is this level, though? HP for a normal enemy, though. There's no possible way. Yeah, no, I'm not leveling up anytime soon. Okay, just a fence on the side. You never know. Oh, what are the end of the tunnel? Maybe I could finally fight Let's Shake. You get a save with a video game toilet. I'm probably coming to the end of it now, actually. Uh, again, for a level, this is on the long side. Can I check my funds by any chance? 18,000? How expensive is stuff in this game if we get an 18,000 level one? Oof, getting bright. Let's see if we got Let's Shake. Even though you know we don't, but... What? What? When did an elevator happen? I love that shirt. Oh, who's this guy? Electro Triple Star. Visitor, I've been waiting. 
My name is Electro Triple Star, the main character of the amazing hit game Electric Thunder Tiger. Triple Star, I know you. I played that for days at the arcade. The industrial monster designs are badass, and your big cannon was even more awesome. I see. You're a video game superstar, and my hero. Visitor, why do we fight? Blood. The visitor fights for bloodthirst. Only for that. It just gets my blood rushing. You feel it too, right? Electricity is my blood. Your arrival gets my electricity rushing. It's a bad omen. Blood and electricity, huh? Do you have a family? Yeah. Are they important to you? How many answers are there to that question? What about you? I was unable to protect my beloved family. Fighting me will result in making your family grieve. Oh wow. Don't worry, I'll send you on your way back to your family. Maybe it's because this is an action game, but the only stage prepared for us is one on which to fight. What, you want to do a BBQ together? Me, I'll pass. You are right. All right then, draw your sword. Okay, and you power up. Once this text disappears, we do this. This game is so on the nose. Badass. Sid51 loves his intriguing boss battle, so I'm curious. Wow. Big Cannon is awesome. Nope. Sit down, buddy. Whoa, hello. I kind of like this guy. Ooh, got me. But I'm over halfway done with him. He's spawning green and he's good. Although I think the real trick here is that he wants me to recharge. Ouch. Sir. Nope. Go over there, please. Visitor, do you live up to your name? Visitor, you're good. You're wasting your life as an assassin. Live in the world of video games. Games are supposed to be played, not lived. I want you to be in my next game. I'll text you later. Contact me anytime if you'd like. Whatever. Anyway, hurry up and change phase. You're not telling me this is the end, right? As you wish. Now for phase two. Amazing. Seriously? This dude is batshit crazy. I like it, Triple Star. I call upon electricity with body and soul. Electronic shooting star. Alright. Hello. Oh, damn. Normal attacks will not work. Destroy those lights. I tried rolling. You all saw it. God, that's so satisfying. Bam! Amazing. Gah! That's a deep break. That felt damn good. This isn't over yet, Travis. 
No way. Tonight I am especially strong. Bitchin'. Visitor, defeat me and take this world in your hands. Whoa. Let's go. I'm very excited. Loads of damage, baby. I hit him with the shotgun blast to point blank. Oh! -ho! Whoa. I just avoided that. Okay, I'm actually injured now, so let's do this. Let's not do this, let's do this. I might actually die, because I'm being a little sloppy at the last second. One more good hit. I have a plan now. I have a plan. Here it comes. Nope. I win. Finish. Do I press? Okay. Wrestling moves. It wouldn't be a Super 51 game without him. No more heroes. Press the arrow to wrestle. <laughs> Great. I got him. Wow. A rank. Yeah, I never did charge attack. I did a good job. God! To become legend is painful. Visitor, this is true pain. I now know pain. The pain only the defeated know. You are past redemption, visitor. Will this world be saved or destroyed? Do with it as you like. I don't need to be told. I'll do as I like anyway. I thank you. I was uncomfortable here. Maybe I was waiting for your arrival. I wish we could have met somewhere else. Farewell, my hero. Goodbye, Triple Star. This world salutes you. You gave us a bit of peace and order. The next Death Driver shall take on the deletion of the Destroyer. You calling me a destroyer? I could get used to it, but I really hate those stereotypical anti-hero types. You've cleared the game. <laughs> Is that a Switch cartridge, even though I'm playing on PS4? <laughs> Wing chip. Why did I get two trophies for that? Did I get one of them for doing a good job on the first boss? Because, like, I got two trophies of the same thing. Oh, General Ledger, the, the wrestling prompts annoyed you in the first game because it wasn't a left-handed setting. At the same time, though, like, the game didn't really care. Just kind of waggle the stick sort of in the direction you're supposed to and it'll just do it. And yeah, Winterburn, it totally says, like, WG wasted. That's kind of funny. I fought my old hero, Triple Star. Was it a dream? Was it real life? When I fight assassins, my mind just goes blank. It's like a form of etiquette between two people fighting to the death. As always, I took three deep breaths and closed my eyes. But this time, my trick for clearing my emotions didn't seem to work. Triple Star was right in front of my eyes. My own personal superstar. Memories of childhood came flooding back. My emotions were out of whack. I killed my own hero. No more he <laughs> No more heroes. Someday, one of these days, Electric Thunder Tiger 3 will be back. I bet Devo Devolver's gonna buy the rights and make a sequel. Wow. Alright. <laughs> that reminds me, the trailer for this game was really funny because I think it was a joke about No More he Oh, no, no, it wasn't the trailer for this game. It was the trailer for No More Heroes 3, because people were waiting forever for that game. And in the trailer for the game, it said something like, 
coming this summer or whatever and then travis's voiceover comes and he's like like you sure about that or like are you that confident or, or something like that it was pretty funny like you really think you're gonna do it a man can hope can't he also att3 is gonna feature travis touchdown i don't know what that is actually like as a sidekick or some shit good night triple star you were a true hero this this game is extremely meta i can't believe this Oh! In the trailer, you can use the Death Drive Mark II to start new games, buy and change t-shirts, and view other materials like faxes or the archives. New t-shirt. New article. Fax from K. Why does that sound familiar? Was there a K in... Was it like K Entertainment from um, One or More Heroes? New scenario. Head for your motorcycle. Save? Yeah. I'll check out the trailer before wrapping up the stream. Hey, look, a more full-size bathroom. Oh, this is the No More Heroes 1 save with the, the toilet paper strip, like, across the screen. That's great. And it, like, follows his junk so you don't see it. Thank you, by the way. Much appreciated censorship. So here's the bathroom. Look at this! This gamer rig. On the PC, you can buy t-shirts and check the ramen blog. Ramen blog. Oh, man! Oh, but that- whoa. Do I have to pay 50,000 points? Tokyo Shoyu, an extremely simple ramen. Slurp up the opaque soup while taking in the aroma of soy sauce to really relax. The noodles are the flat, intertwining Hirauchimen type. Yep, this is Edo. This is old school ramen. It's like your tongue went on a funky journey through time. It also comes with a boiled egg. Hard, not soft, lol. Thick cut char siu pork and lots of green onions. Grab some pot stickers while you're at it. A lot of them. And what? You're, and you're gonna need a beer, too. What? No beer? The ramen was stellar, but no beer means a penalty of negative 50,000 points. Goshi sosama deshita. Alright. So, oh, it's negative 50,000 points? That's funny. 89. Delicious. This is confirmed. Alright. Uh, so the Hakata Tonkatsu. An aroma that keeps you coming back for more like a good hot spring and that milky white tonkatsu soup. I wish I could jump right into that soup and unwind after a long day. Slurp up those thin, firm noodles quickly before they go soggy. Looking up, I notice a sign on the wall saying, Free noodle refills for the two bowls. Without hesitation, I score another bowl full of super firm noodles. The taste of Hakata blooms inside my mouth, and the beer doesn't exist. What the hell? I try dumping in a bunch of pickled ginger as a pick-me-up, then another bowl full of noodles. Hey, it's my life. The ramen was good, but due to the missing beer, negative 10 million points. <laughs> Come on. Freaking busted. And then there's more. So, uh, t-shirt shop. There's, like, straight-up video game tees in this. Yeah, Hyperlight, Drifter, Dead Cells, Mulaka, or the Atlantis. I don't know those. Dander, I've heard of. American Dream, Brawlout, Demombo, Fury. Oh, my God. Hollow Knight. Th these are, like... They really chose the quality stuff. 2064 Read Only Memories. I have it, but I haven't played it. Fallen Legion, SteamWorld Dig 2. Oh, Cyberpunk Brawler Action Valhalla. It's very hard to read. They scrunched the title. Children of Zodiaro, Stifled, Morphe's Law, Blazing Chrome, Treachery and Beatdown City, Double Kick Heroes, Disco Elysium, Bit Trip Runner, Floor Kids, Pocket Rumble, Wargroove, Pato Box. What? They gave Pato Box a shout out? Super Hot Papers, please. Freaking Thumper? Suda, you absolute mad lad. Nuclear Throne, Golf Story, Stanley Parable, Salt and Sanctuary. Oh, Yik, a postmodern RPG, Y2K. Just Shapes and Beats, Galaxy, Undertale, Wolverblade, Black the Fall, Riot Civil Unrest, Rain Worlds, Tarotika Voodoo, Saturday Morning RPG, Zarvat. I am not reading that. Oh, it says at the bottom. Oh, the missing! Sweary shout out. Suda51 and Sweary60. What? 63? La Mulana 2. Blackbird. I miss Blackbird. Uh, Olija. Downwell. Pikuniku. Ape. Oh my god. Ape out. High Hell. Ruiner. The Red Strings Club. The Messenger. Mother Russia Bleeds. Absolver. Gauze will be watching. Swords of Ditto. Minute. This is an insane amount of shoutouts to indie titles. This is ridiculous. Hatoful, Boyfriend, 
Reigns, Crossing Souls, Enter the Gungeon, Lufthrausers, Hotline Miami. Mm. So I could spend regular money for these, but these cost like the big coins. Hazray 3, Hazray 2, Hazray 1, Grease, of course. Dropsy, Dropsy's a good one. Gorn, Hazray 4, Sword of Legends, Donut, Continue or Die, Chicken Wing, Face Lock, Tombstone Pile Driver. Plane 2, Plane 1, Striped Smoke, Power of Justice, Mummy, TSA Logo. God damn, this is a lot of good stuff. This is a lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. And nothing seems to cost more than one of these AZS coins. Ugh. Oh, where do I start? Fury. You're goddamn right. Hollow Knight. Hyperlight Drifter. I've only played a little bit of it, but we're, we're buying it. Oh no, it's too expensive. I only have 4,000. Ah! Yeah, I'll get rid of the ending stuff. It's fine. No. More expensive thing. Alright, RIP my money. Alright, so for the, the AZS coins. Ape out, though. The Messenger. Hala Miami, hands down. Gungeon, hands down. I've actually played Dropsy, but shout out to Hoddleful Boyfriend and Ape Out. Maybe I'll do Ape Out. Oh my god, such quality decisions! Also, Unreal logo on the right, the uh, desktop icon. This game, good lord. Mm. How do I choose which t-shirt to wear? Can I do it here? I'm not leveling up. Facts. Number 10,100k. Before you begin the game, I want you to think hard for a second. Which is more important to you, your life or video games? This console, the DD Mark II, brings death to its players. You played it. You should know this better than anyone. Diving into the world of the Death Drive will indeed make for an amazingly immersive experience. At the same time, the longer you spend inside, the more severe the damage is to your brain. Even now, in just that single instant, your brain has been thrown into fear and rage with a horribly disturbing white noise and signals from the machine. You're a clever guy, so I'm sure you've noticed it yourself. The construction of the human brain is extremely delicate and precise. The signals sent from this game destroy your brain tissue extremely easily, and it can even burn off your nerve tissue. I pray you'll turn back now while you can. God bless America. K. Huh. Archives? Articles from the magazine. That's right, Mark, too. Uh, well... Uh... With only three months left to launch, we have no announcement regarding what it will be, but Carlos Atagaya is here to fill you in on his predictions for the console. Including actual Hasray employees, that's what that is. I'm predicting huge specs, 66 megabytes, 64 megabytes main unit, 2 megabytes DAT tapes, process games at ludicrous speeds, is this old cassette tape console. Editorial department has juicy info, there's a pot attached to the console. The pot comes attached as a crucial part of the console itself. You'll be able to cook around while you play. <laughs> Double mouse? What is any of this? Unprecedented new kind of controller? I think it's gonna be a square with one button. Hold on to and wave around in the air to use. It'll come with two of them. Amazing. Uh, doesn't even require a TV. I no longer have any idea what's going on with this thing. Uh, I think it's gonna be able to talk. If not, then you need a TV. Duh. What about peripherals? There's a slot on the side. I think there's going to be a peripheral. Also, that pot. Is a chemical you put in the pot that'll affect the tapes and make hidden stages appear or something? <laughs> what kind of games will hit the market? The sequel to Electric Thunder Tiger is slated for release. I'm super hyped. Freaking weird. Super duper hot scoop. And uh, Electric Thunder Tiger 2. It's finally here. Three years since the arcade hit. Threes and fours. Electro Tower can be shining in the back. The boss awaits you there. 
It's famous, it's famous kill move, the big cannon, guaranteed to you deal huge damage. Here's the guy. The Ultima Cyberpunk TPS action game is here. His whole body is a weapon. 200 IQ, the hero family man. The year is 2223. The city has had its lights stolen. The AI controlled construction machines abandoned beneath the city have gone crazy. We need electric triple star. Tim Ford. Why does that sound familiar? Uh, his enemies have risen from the underground once again. Oh no, the temperature's dropped 20 degrees. The clock is ticking for the citizens. He lives in town with his wife and daughters. He loves electric type weapons. He met his wife at the toast gym. All right. Use the aroma pot to trip balls. Uh, head toward the place in the photo. Once you've arrived, drop some eucalyptus, paper bark, and bergamot oils into the aroma pot attached to the console. Let the oils diffuse for 10 minutes. And then you and Travis will absolutely trip balls. <laughs> Uh, recover HP with command input. Left, left, down, up, left, left, down, up, uh, left, left, down, right. D do you think that's real? Apparently hidden characters pop up too. Do you think that's real? I gotta try that. Uh, wipe out pickled bogaro to score treasure. At the place in the photo, input this command. You find the pickled bogaro. Huh. Wow. Left, left, down, up, left, left, down, right. It's the same thing. So pay attention to the location of the cult. This is amazing. Oh, up here. Okay, I already read that. This is amazing. Death drive. Can I like change shirts that I'm wearing though? This is the death drive itself. Watch your thunder tiger. That might just be level one again. I'm gonna back off. Motorcycles for like new area. Shiny car, can't use. Guy sleeping is bad man. But wasn't he trying to kill me? Like what is the lore here? Oh my God, I forgot. That's what it meant, Gene at the camp. I forgot. Travis's kitty cat is named Gene. I forgot about that. You could pet the cat in No More Heroes 1, but I don't know if I'm getting that in two. Bathroom. I bought my shirts, but how do I change the shirts? PC? That's the shop, though. It's buy shirts. How do I change shirts? Like, I got the thing in the corner right there, but I don't think I can get it. I might have to deal with it, like, in the gameplay. Skills? Eh. I could level up Batman as well. Ah, in the bathroom we could change t-shirts and save. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. T-shirts. Travis. Default. Hollow Knight. Fury. You can't really see the ape out, unfortunately. The messenger. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is obscured. Gungeon. Hotline Miami, that's freaking amazing. Unreal, striped. Plain TSA, alright. Hollow Knight, like you can actually see it. But I am tempted by Fury and uh, Hotline Miami. Well, Hotline Miami, you, again, you can't quite read it. I think I'll go Hollow Knight. Oh, I got a trophy just for that, thank you. And now I shall save. Damn, I'm looking good. All right, now we're talking, now we're talking. Okay, this is where I'm going to wrap it up, so thank you very much everybody for joining the stream, and have a wonderful night.